Welcome back to Money Makes. My name is Callie, and today we are going to be making a really moist and simple and soft chocolate olive oil buns cake. So last week I shared with you my cardamom citrus olive oil bun cake, which is really delicious. Check out that recipe video as well. I'll link it in the description box below. And this week we are going to be making a chocolate version of that, and it doesn't get any better than chocolate, so you know you are gonna love this recipe. I love olive oil based cakes. They add just the most perfect, tender, and like I said, soft and moist texture that is impossible to beat. So let's get right into it but before we begin as always please remember to subscribe like share chat in the comment section and follow me on social media for more recipes and additional content so these are the ingredients that you are going to need first we have some brown sugar granulated sugar i also have a few eggs some plain greek full fat yogurt some vanilla extract salt extra virgin olive oil of course as well as well as flour, baking powder, baking soda, cocoa powder, as well as a little bit of instant coffee or espresso powder, which is optional, highly recommended. My oven is preheated to 350 degrees Fahrenheit. Get that nice and hot and ready to go. And um, I, we do have some additional ingredients that we will go over later as far as the um, chocolate glaze goes, which is incredible. So let's do this. Uh, first, what I'm gonna do is take all of my dry ingredients. So that's my flour, baking powder, baking soda, cocoa powder, and some coffee and espresso powder. And I'm gonna add some salt. So I'm gonna give this a quick mix to incorporate. Okay, that's good enough. It doesn't need to be perfect. And so I'm going to set this aside momentarily and I'm gonna grab both types of sugar and to this, I'm gonna throw in my eggs and I'm gonna switch over to my whisk and give this a mix until it is all nice and creamy. Okay, so next go in the vanilla extract as well as the um, the yogurt. So a lot of times in my cakes, I use um, buttermilk, but in this recipe, I just feel like the Greek yogurt kind of goes with the olive oil sort of Mediterranean vibes. Um, not that this is really, it's not an authentic recipe, but still, we're gonna keep with the same sort of ingredients. So I'm gonna add this all in and give it a mix. Okay, that looks good. I also tossed in the vanilla extract. I don't remember if I said that, but I did. So next, I'm gonna add in the dry ingredients and give this a mix, and then I'm gonna clean up, and then we'll bake this up. Okay, so I just added the batter into my greased bun pan. I just greased it with a little bit of olive oil, vegetable oil, butter, anything will do. And I'm just kind of distributing the batter around it evenly, like so. And next up, this is gonna bake in my 350 degree Fahrenheit preheated oven for about 35 to 40 minutes. You'll know when it's done baking when you insert a knife or skewer into the center and it comes out clean or with a few crumbs. Once it finishes baking, then I'm gonna let it sit at room temperature after I invert it onto a plate and we will work on the glaze. Okay, we're back. This baked for 40 minutes. I let it cool a little bit before I inverted it out onto a plate, as you can see here, and I let it cool completely. It's very important that you let it cool completely. We'll talk about that more in a second. Okay, so for the glaze, what you're gonna need is some dark chocolate that I just melted with a little bit of olive oil in the microwave and some powdered sugar. That's it. So I'm just going to combine these ingredients and give them a whisk until they're nice and creamy. Okay, so this looks good. So next, all we're gonna do is just add this delicious frosting, ganache sort of topping all over the top of the bun cake. And remember, it's supposed to be a little kind of rustic, so it doesn't need to be perfect. Let it kind of drip down the sides. It's gonna be delicious. So next up, I'm gonna finish icing this cake and then I'm gonna give you a close up so you can get a visual of just how moist and tender and absolutely delicious this chocolate olive oil bun cake really is. For the full written recipe and instructions, head to my blog, MooneyMakesRecipes.com. I'll put the link for that in the description box below. Click on the link, the recipe will come right up and make this chocolate olive oil bun cake. I promise you're gonna love it and let me know what you think because I'd love to hear from you. Thank you so much, I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.